Hey guys, Dory on the Beat here, and um, I just want to let you know this is my first live video doing a review on a cosmetic company. And the cosmetic company that I chose to do a review on was Smashbox Cosmetics. They have been supporting me and always sending me products, and I absolutely love their products. So I'm going to be reviewing their primers, some lip glosses, some highlighters, and um, it should be fun, so stay tuned. So first, I want to talk about their primers. So the primers that I receive and that I use all the time are one ounce primers. And the first one is the original, which is oil free. Um, I believe that it also has like different things in it. I know it has vitamin A, vitamin E, grapeseed oil, but it minimizes fine lines and pores. A little bit goes a long way, but um, it gives you a nice matte finish and it keeps your makeup looking fresh all day. The next one is for more sensitive skin. So it basically does the same thing, but it's really good for oily acne skin, but it's for sensitive skin. So it comes in a one ounce, it looks just like the other one, but it says light on the box. And um, it's really, really good for sensitive skin, but it does the same thing. It does minimize lines and wrinkles as well as pores. Uh, the next one that we have is color corrector so I'll just show you both of them at the same time so you have a peach one and you have a green one so the peach one um, takes away like different blemishes on your skin discolorations um, and you know it's good for for warm skin because it is a peach color tone the next one is green and this of course uh, knocks out red so if you have a little bit of rosacea any redness to your skin this is amazing they both do the same thing as these two, they minimize lines, pores, and wrinkles, and they're oil-free. And last but not least is the Smashbox Pore Perfector. So this really minimizes pores. So I think the difference in this one is that it um, instantly reduces the pores, but it lasts for eight hours. So when I got this one, I thought it was blue, but it's not blue. Just the packaging is blue. So when you open it up, I'm going to swatch it for you because it's a little different. As you can see, it's a little thicker. Um, and when you rub it, you can really see that it blurs out your skin. So this is really good if you have large pores or if you feel like your pores are really showing through your makeup. This is the best primer to minimize your pores. Trust me when I tell you, I use it all the time. It's great. I just wanted you to know it's not blue. It's like beige. Alright, moving right along. I love these. So these were created by Cassie Holmes. So she worked with Smashbox to create these beautiful highlighters. I love the packaging of the boxes. It's like so pretty. Uh, this is, she gives you instructions on how to use it and if you want a subtle glow or if you want like a really like intense glow. She goes through the whole process with you, which is pretty awesome for people who don't know how to use highlighter. So um, I got two of them. I got gold, which is really pretty. And I got pearl. So pearl is a little lighter, of course, and a little bit more pinkier, but they're both beautiful. I have tried both on clients, and they absolutely love them. Um, they create a great luminosity to the skin over foundation or like a tint, like a tint moisturizer or anything. It looks really, really good. So I really love these. And they're like so cute. Next are these two guys, which I absolutely love. So these are called Smashbox Halo Highlighting Wands. So everyone likes a little bit of highlight in their life, right? These are awesome. One is gold and one is pearl. So just take the and take those little caps off so, so I can show you. So I squeezed them already because you got to pump them a few times so that I could swatch it for you. So one is gold and one is pink, as you can see. And they are so beautiful and they're subtle. So if you don't want too much highlight, but you want your skin to, you know, have like a little luminosity, a little glow to it, that's it. So that's the gold and that's the pearl. And they're very, very pretty. And of course they go right on the highlights wherever light reflects. So here, down your nose, your cupid's bow, you can put a little bit on your chin. You can even put some right here underneath your brow to get that little highlight effect, you know, and they're beautiful and they're very soft and very natural looking. 
very nice. So I want to talk about the ombre lipsticks. So I actually have one on. I believe I have sunset ombre. So ombre is when you put colors from dark to light. So in this particular one, as you see, that's the fuchsia. And then when you flip it, you got a lavender and an orange. So what I did was I put the fuchsia first. I lined my lips almost like a lip pencil. And then I went in with the orange and the lavender in the middle. And this is sort of the effect that I got, which I love. I love these ombre lipsticks. They make doing ombre, ombre, ombre so easy. This is a nude one. You can wear it every day, which I love. Clients love this. This is awesome. I don't even use pencil with these at all. And this is the red one, which is really, really nice. You sort of got that brick red as a liner. And then your regular red and a little bit of orange. So it really creates that, that pout in the lips for reds, you know? And last but not least, let's talk about these metallics. These metallic lip glosses, they're pretty awesome, guys. You can wear them with lipstick. You can wear them without lipstick. You can wear them with lip gloss. They're amazing. Um, one of my favorites is the chrome red. I use it all the time on clients, and they love it. We also have, like, this beautiful orange one. I can actually tell you the names of them if you want. Uh, this is called, what is this called? Hater Age. Hey, for all the haters out there, Hater Age. Um, this one is called, of course, I told you, Crimson Red. And this one is called Brains and Bronze. I like that. We all need some brains when it comes to looking good. We need to have this too, Brains. And last but not least, we have Foil Brat, which is like so cute. I love it. I'm actually going to swatch it so you can see what it looks like. It's so pretty. I love this. Isn't that pretty? It's very iridescent and very pretty. Clients love these. So there you have it. I hope you like it. I hope you go out there and buy some of the products because they're awesome. And um, I hope you enjoyed my review. Till next time, take care. Bye.